Hi ladies, hi gents, I want to share a quick video with you today and it's a design team project for the Wild Bunch, Wild Orchid Crafts um, so I'm going to get straight into it so let me just move that out of the way okay um, I'm just going to show you my project this is my project um, let me just readjust, there we go um, so it's a shabby chic heart and um, the actual heart shape is polystyrene I've got a circle one here, I only had one heart one so it's just one of these polystyrene shapes and um, I just covered it using uh, some uh, muslin type fabric and I just took strips of it and tied it round like this. I done a double knot. So that's what I did all the way around and covered the whole heart just using strips of fabric like that. You can use other fabrics, I just used muslin um, to get all this shabbiness around the outside. Um, I'll just give you a close-up of that and you can just see where it's tied all the way around. Um, and I absolutely love how that turned out. I am going to be doing this one as well <laughs> for another project. Um, so the flowers, uh, what I did then is I added two of the uh, Light Mocha Gardenia flower sprays, these ones. So you have to just arrange them out how you want them. Open the leaves out. So I used two of these, uh, one this side and one this side. And I absolutely love these sprays. And their um, product code is MKX644. I will pop all the codes down below. So that's what I started with, two, two of the sprays. And then um, I popped uh, some of the chrysanthemums uh, down the bottom here. And I used some of the white and some of this brown tone. And they were from the, the mixed tone, earth tone pack. And that's QVR077. And these uh, earth tones are gorgeous. I absolutely love them. So I just popped some of those in there. Um, and then I did add... Uh, some more fabric in between the flowers and some of the stamen, uh, the white stamen, which are MKX470, which are these ones. And I just pop those in between the flowers and some fabric. If I just show you close up. Here. So you can see. So I use some of the stem in here, in between the flowers, and then I just pop some fabric with the stem in, in the centre in between the flowers, and then up here as well. And I love these stem in, they are so gorgeous. And just it popped in between the flowers, it looks so cute. I will take some pictures and pop it at the end of the video. And then to finish it off, um, I made two fabric flowers and um, just using the mus uh, muslin fabric as well. And, and then I used two of the pearl centers, which are from the mixed color set, which is GST171. And these are new to the store and I absolutely love them. And they come in such yummy colours as well. And I'm absolutely thrilled that um, 
wild orchid crafts for selling these because they are quite hard to get hold of. And I absolutely love how they look on on the flowers. Um, and of course you can fray it and make it even more shabby and yummy. And I have added just a little hanger here just so that it can hang up. Uh, so that's my project. I really hope you like it. And you know, if you if you can um, get any of these, just tying fabric onto it is is a fantastic way to cover it. No glue involved, so really easy. Um, so I really hope you like how this turned out. And like I say, I will pop all the links down below and all the product codes of the flowers that I've used and the the pearl centers. And um, I will take close up so you can see in a little bit more detail. And um, thank you for watching and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye for now.